Hey, we're Pip and Soph. Uh, great to be able to talk to you from lockdown. Uh, for us, lockdown uh, looks like mostly study in the morning. So we jump on uh, to online classes. Um, after that, we'll have a bit of lunch together. Uh, we'll do some study, go for a walk. Um, and then at night time, we like to watch a movie, enjoy some dinner um, and then head to bed. Uh, I guess the, the most difficult thing about lockdown is feeling like a slug uh, a lot of the time um, when you're in the same space all the time, um, every day starts to blur into the next. And so um, staying mentally sharp and physically active is probably the hardest challenge. But, um, uh, you know, we're doing OK, I guess, in that area. Um, for us, there have been many blessings um, in lockdown. Uh, we're living in a college community with other college students. Um, so it's nice to be surrounded by people who are in the same um, position as us. Um, yeah, even though we can't really spend a lot of time with our neighbours, it's nice to be able to wave to someone in the backyard, putting out their washing. Um, yeah, or just be able to see people walking around the apartment building. Um, and we also share a backyard with them, which is sort of nice. Um, we've still been able to uh, be in touch with family and friends. Um, we've been having a lot of fun Zoom calls. Um, and yeah, lots of people have been messaging us and looking out for us, which is a real blessing. Now, Ephesians 4, 1 to 16, which we're looking at, um, is a great encouragement to us and a reminder that um, we need each other. The church needs each other. Um, and in lockdown, that's no different. We need people um, who build us up and encourage us with words of encouragement, uh, reminders from scripture. Um, and yeah, there are plenty of people that we seek to encourage as well. Um, and just remembering that, that Jesus is the head of the church and he's the one who has blessed us all so richly in so many ways. But one of the ways that he blesses us is by giving us each other um, to build each other up in the faith. And so we're super thankful for being part of the Penrith Church family at this time. I think um, Ephesians for me reminds me that um, there is no lone wolf as a Christian. Uh, we're all part of the one body. And in Ephesians 1 16, we're commanded to, to grow in maturity together, grow into the body of Christ. Um, and you can't do that by yourself uh, just at home. You uh, do that with other people, love other people, um, grow and encourage one another. Um, that just reminds me that we're, we're all in this together, as cheesy as that sounds. Um, yeah, growing up into the body of Christ. We hope you're going okay, uh, whatever your situation is at the moment. And we hope that we can see you uh, in the flesh um, in the not too distant future. See ya. See ya.